Hello and welcome to another video from Ward Antiques. Following from our previous video where we looked at a Wedgwood Jasperware 1953 sugar bowl, we're fortunate to have another piece of this set, uh, which is this time the teapot. Wedgwood started to sell Jasperware in the late 1770s and this teapot was made in 1953 to commemorate Queen Elizabeth II's coronation. Jasperware is still being made today and over the years there's been a huge variety of types and styles produced. Apprentices at, the, at Wedgwood train for up to 10 years which really shows the time and attention the company puts into its products. Jasperware has been produced in a number of different colours with the pale or Wedgwood blue as is shown on these two being the most popular. Jasperware has a matte unglazed finish and the relief decorations are usually produced in white to contrast the main colour although other colours of relief has occasionally been used. These reliefs, which is the, the white bits on here, um, are produced in moulds and applied as sprigs, which is a, a pottery technique. The formula for Jasperware has been kept confidential by Wedgwood and has been named after the mineral Jasper. It's our intention to, to get quite a collection of Jasperware together and um, do a, a quite a detailed video on, on it in the future. Wedgwood has a long history with the British royal family, with Josiah Wedgwood producing sets for Queen Charlotte in the 1700s. And one of the royal wedding cakes when Queen Elizabeth and Prince Philip got married was in Wedgwood blue with white detailing to make it look like a Wedgwood piece, which shows just how fond the royal family is of the company. That makes this commemorative piece and set even more interesting. This teapot is in the Wedgwood blue Jasperware colour with the white Jasper relief moulded decoration. Inside of the teapot there is the glazing, as is common with all of the um, Wedgwood teaware, as you can imagine, because it's going to be holding water. The teapot is decorated with the images of Queen Elizabeth or on the one side and Prince Philip on the other side uh, with the text obviously there His Royal Highness Duke of Edinburgh and on this side the HM Queen Elizabeth II and obviously the date's June 1953. Part of the decoration is on both obviously the Queen and on Prince Philip having the crowns above their heads to commemorate the coronation for which this set was produced. And as with the sugar bowl, there is the leaf and berry white jasper relief around the spout, the handle, and obviously the lid of the teapot as well. So the size is four and a half inches high by nine inches from the spout to the end of the handle, and the width that way is about six inches. The condition of this one um, is absolutely fantastic. So underneath the teapot is the uh, all-important stamp to obviously let us know that it's genuine. And this one's 1953 Coronation, Wedgwood, Pale Blue Jasper, Made in England. I'm trying to find out how many of these were produced, so if I do, I'll add it into the comments at a later date. Well, I really like these pieces, both for the history of them and also the style. Uh, we're working on acquiring some more of this set, uh, so please leave us some comments on your thoughts and whether you, you're as fond of them as I am. Um, these limited edition runs really interest me, as obviously they're never going to be produced again and are a really great item of history. That's all for today. Thanks for watching. And if you enjoyed this video, please check out our others and give them a like and subscribe to us to be kept up to date with our new items. If there is anything you would particularly like us to feature, please drop me a message or add it into the comments and we'll see what we can do. Goodbye for now.